On the walls that remind him of the fragile state of Afghanistan, artist Kabir Mokamel is sending messages to the Afghan people. When you put an image on a wall, the wall disappears. And it is the best place actually to paint or draw on, you know, so, and, uh, and one of the other things is, you know, like for a lot of people, they see blast wall, I see canvases. You know. This work is about the dangers of migration. Afghans were the second largest group of migrants to arrive in Europe last year. And volunteers help paint and hang posters in this installation, which represents how smugglers see Afghans who want to leave their country. Here, the smugglers are shown as sharks. And yet Hullah Hekmat watched his friends leave Afghanistan one by one. While they've reached Europe safely, he says they're not happy there. Life isn't what they expected. When our people go illegally abroad, they face a lot of problems. Today, we are highlighting that, and we hope it will help prevent migration in the future. 16-year-old Yalda Yakubi found out about the art on social media and wanted to join in. Because everyone's leaving their country and going out of country, and uh, our country is going backwards, so we have to work hard and, and, and to take it forward. The art does ignite debate. This man is asking how long Afghans will have to suffer. When will the world listen, he says. This isn't the first painting this group has done, and they say it won't be the last. It's part of a continuing campaign to raise awareness about a host of social issues. There's a series celebrating ordinary heroes like the police and street sweepers. Other works criticize corruption. My mission is, you know, for my, myself, you know, to actually create that awareness and people to think about something, not just do it, you know. Think critically. That's the most important thing. This work is on one of the busiest streets in the center of the capital. Thousands walk or drive by it every day. Not all may agree with the message, but for Kabir, it's enough that it's out there. Jennifer Glass, TRT World, Kabul.